Welcome back to a brand new video once again. It is me, Cineman, and today we have a more serious type of video, guys. I'm sorry that this video isn't full of positivity and happiness like my other ones, but this video we need to talk, guys. So, you guys might not know a lot about me, so. If you guys don't want your mood mood to be down or anything, or you don't want to hear any negativity or sadness, just please click to another one of my videos. So, thank you guys for what I want to start off with is thank you guys so much for 20 subscribers. You guys are honestly the best, and I couldn't imagine my YouTube without you guys. But I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you guys a little about me, so, yeah, I guess that, where should I start, I guess, well, ever since I was little, I was, I was always the odd kid out, I was the one that people would never play with, and they would always pick me la last in like, in like games and everything, because I was just, I wasn't the best looking kid, and I wasn't, and I definitely wasn't, like, I, I didn't have, like, an outgoing personality, I was shy and everything, so not many people knew me, and not many people wanted to know me, and people treated me bad a little, sorry about that, I guess, so, yeah, that's, that's really annoying, so... Alright, so I I changed to this one, so shout out to 8 hours of no sound. You guys can check out this video, but I really don't want sound right now. So to be honest, I'm really just depressed and everything. I mean, my life hasn't been the best. So let me tell you a little bit about myself. I've, I was, I was a rich kid. Well, I still am. But money couldn't buy me friends or love, so so I had this one best friend. Her name was Saffron, and she ended up killing herself. So you guys can already imagine how much that hurted me and how much it affected me. So so ever since then, my life has never been the same. So, as you guys probably might know from my Lawn Bro channel, I'm originally, or originally from France, and so I moved to United States when I was about 8 years old, or something. So, ever since then, moving, I have I always had mixed feelings about, about being in the United States. I mean, I mean, like, out of the rumors, even from Americans, people say, it's the worst country, but that's besides the point. I never, I never really got along with people. I mean, I did try to say hi and everything, but people would either just ignore me or just laugh, and and like and like I got bullied a lot, so that really took a, a toll on me. So as I was growing up. I, my depression was getting worse and worse, and I actually still have it to this day, and, and now I'm in, I'm in high school right now, and it isn't the best experience for me, I'm, I'm really just, I feel like these years of my life, like my teenage years, are the worst. And some people will be like, yeah, it's, it's normal that way. And yes, teenagers are are just a lot, a lot of things just happen in those years. But I don't believe that. I feel like this case is honestly different. I'm just really depressed. And even though I have a girlfriend and everything, she makes me so happy and I love her so much. Sometimes we get into fights like every couple and everything. And she has a lot on her plate too. But I, I've been scared to tell her that 
I have a lot on my plate as well. I am still struggling with my depression and I'm still and I'm still upset about everything. And and we just got off the phone not that long ago talking about being there for each other and everything and I left that conversation feeling bad I didn't tell her this but if she sees this video now she knows how I truly feel I feel I just feel so overwhelmed and I feel I get bullied on the daily at school and I feel like I just feel like nothing's going my way of course, of course, things don't always go in people's ways and everything, but I just feel like life should give me a break a little, at least just a small one, because I have to deal with an, abu an abusive dad, uh, an aunt that doesn't care, and, and if you guys are asking about my siblings, my siblings really don't pay any mind to me. And, and, and my girlfriend, she, she fixes some of these problems too, but sometimes, just sometimes things can't be fixed. So, so recently I started drawing and I don't call myself the best artists in the world some people say my art is really good and i should continue and everything so i don't know about my drawings but anyway i was i've been drawing how i feel and writing about it in a diary my if you if you guys ever saw my diary it's dark and how and how i'm truly feeling but i decided to tell how i truly feel on a youtube video because you guys can really know how I how I feel and and hopefully you guys can relate to me. I know not everything goes people's ways and I know that pe everyone has a hard time. Some people have harder times than others, but but I feel like you shouldn't kick people when they're down and you shouldn't and you shouldn't like Think about the next time you make a bad comment about someone. That comment can really hurt somebody or even end their life. And and for for me, I've hurt so much. I mean, I barely do face cam videos because I'm just so self-conscious about how people think about me and everything. But but that's. But if you guys really want me to do a face cam, just tell me in the comments. And I know there's going to be assholes like, oh, you're such a crybaby and everything. But this is just a video to tell how I feel. And and I just feel like, I just feel so alone and in darkness. And I know everything is going to get better. And I won't do anything to harm myself or anything like that. Don't worry, guys. But... I just feel more alone than I have ever been in my life. And YouTube is the one thing that makes me feel a little bit better about life. And 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 I know there and and I've gotten hate comments, but I won't let it affect me. It's just I feel I feel so alone and in darkness and I feel like not even my girlfriend understands how I'm truly feeling. And I just wish people could see the other side of me, the one, the one that's really behind the voice of that gaming video you guys are watching. This is the real me. I'm really just sad and depressed and everything, and and I'm just happy I could make this video and keep making videos for you guys, and. And yes, I won't make it all about positivity because I hate that stuff. But anyway, I think I'm going to end the video here. Thank you guys if you made it this far. I just wanted to tell you a little bit about myself and how I really feel. And I know things are going to get better. 
So, as long as I have you guys' support, and whoever sees this video that I know in real life, and if they, if they come to me and say, now I know how you feel and support me and everything, thank you in advance. You guys really, really help out my life and everything. So, I'm gonna end the video here. Sorry for the more depressing video, but thank you so much for watching it. You guys really mean a lot to me, and there's not really much else I could say. So, thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, leave a like, and I'll try to make another video by the end of today, depending on how I'm feeling. But anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.